Hey, welcome to uh, Pink Out Night at the Wolf Pack Man YouTube channel. Old man, old packs. Got a cool one today. 1988-89 Fleer Basketball, a wax pack, uh, PSA graded uh, 8. So near mint to mint. Uh, 12 cards, one sticker, the dreaded piece of gum is in here as well. Um, this was the only professional basketball set produced in 1988, so uh, that's cool. This, the base set only has 132 cards in it, also cool. 36 of those are Hall of Famers, also cool. Uh, Bird, Magic, Chris Mullen, Ewing, Barkley, Olajuwon, MJ, you, you name it, man. They were, they were in this set. Uh, also 30 rookies out of 132, including Scottie Pippen, Dennis Rodman, Reggie Miller, John Stockton, the, the greatest point guard of all time. I've said that a zillion times, but his assist total stands alone so i don't have to really argue about it so before we do i crack this open so for those of you who don't want to hang around for this next part of guessing an autograph feel free to fast forward but uh he, here you go basketball it's a basketball autograph Na member of the naismith hall of fame two-time nba champion NBA Most Valuable Player, eight-time NBA All-Star, All-Star Game MVP. He was he was also NBA Rookie of the Year. And this is what this he here's a huge clue. He was a player coach in the NBA in 1978-79, and that's kind of a giveaway. But I'm talking about Dave Cowens, who obviously had a sense of humor. I sent him this magazine page, and he signed it on Kareem's butt. So <laughs> pretty, pretty darn funny, I think. And if one autograph wasn't enough, I have two today because it just happens there's another one on the other side of this um, that I thought, what the heck. But this is a, on the other side, you've got also a member of the Naismith Hall of Fame, this person was born in 1902 and died in 1997, two years after I received his autograph. Uh, so I got his autograph in 1995. His jersey is retired at the University of Kansas after he led the Jayhawks to consecutive national championships in, in the 1930s and also received consecutive All-American awards for those two seasons. And I'm talking about Paul Endicott, who sent me this letter when I requested his autograph. Okay, so 1996, but he, he said, in close are the two autograph cards for my, my kids. I'm sorry that I'm unable to furnish you with all the information you asked for, because at the time I was building a Naismith Basketball Hall of Fame website because none existed and and I just learned through my job how to build web pages so that's what I was doing back then I was writing all the everybody who was still alive who was in the Hall of Fame I was saying hey what would you like me to include on on my website about you, your basketball career and I got some amazing stuff in the mail but for him he said I am 94 years old really do not care for publicity such as you described <laughs> Paul and Endicott. Well, crap, man. Ninety-four. He died. Man, this this must have been. He died in nineteen ninety-seven. So he died the very next year. Wow. Okay. So so wow. That's I didn't realize that. I thought I'd written him a couple years before he died. It just was less than one year before he died. So there's your two autographs. And now it's time to. Uh, have some fun. <laughs> We've all seen Tom's idea of fun. Uh, just, what, am, what am I going to do? I'm going to just do it. So here we go. Let's just do it. Start. 
right. Dun, dun, dun. You're like, come, there's no drama anymore because you're just too good at this. And I'll say thank you. I'm okay with the lack of drama. This is the part I hate. <laughs> God, why do they wedge it in there so tight? Wow. That didn't even budge. Terrifies me to do that. Okay. Be back in a flash. Yes, that was groaning. I'm I'm old. <laughs> So, man, I'd love to get a Jordan out of this pack. Magic Johnson is the sticker, and it is massively waxed up. So that sucks. Wow, this gum is powerful. Serious, serious gun. Gum powder everywhere. So let's take a look. So look at that. Look at that magic. Look at that wax on the back of that. And that is a gob of wax. So the sticker is Magic Johnson, though. That's cool. From Michigan State. I don't know if I ever told the story, but I moved to California my senior year of high school from, from Michigan to California, and it was 1978. Uh, and so I'm starting my senior year at this school in California, and they, they the, tried out for the basketball team. I made the basketball team. The players on the team were, were like, you from East Lansing? Because all they knew was Magic Johnson from East Lansing. <laughs> and the next day they couldn't remember my name, second day of tryouts, but they all, so they started calling me EL for East Lansing. <laughs> it stuck. Oh, look at this. Bill Lambeer. The first card is Bill Lambeer. That, while many of you would not be happy to have that card, I am ecstatic to have this card. <laughs> That's awesome. Magic and Bill. Those are two great cards. Uh, Walter Berry. See, not, not as excited about that card. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, Walter. Um, Ralph Sampson. That's a cool card. Nice. Oh, check it out. Who is that? Who is that next to him? I don't know who that is. Uh, Xavier McDaniel. I remember him. Stud. The X-Man. Vern Fleming for the Pacers. Carl the Mailman Malone. 
All I need is John Stockton to be right behind this mailman card. And it looks like he is laying the ball in over James Worthy. That's what I'm seeing there. Brad Sellers. <laughs> Remember that guy? Tall, skinny guy. So there's a teammate of Michael Jordan's. James Worthy. Oh, that's funny. So James has got like got to represent here. Since Carl, Carl did him bad in that one picture. There's somebody laying on the ground in this picture too. Um, all right. Wow, what do we got left? Four cards left. Larry Bird. All-star card. That's awesome. I got Magic and Larry in the same pack. So cool. Patrick Ewing all-star card. What the heck, man? Look at this. Ralph Sampson, Magic, Carl, Patrick, Larry Worthy. Of course, Bill Lambeer should be in the hall. Uh, oh, Michael Cage flipped over. That one's flipped over the other side for some reason. And Michael Cage. Did I not get a sticker in this? Cliff Levingston. Oh, no, duh. My first card was sticker, duh. Okay, so that was 5, 10, 12. So we got 12 cards and a sticker. Why was I still looking for a sticker? Um, so we had, we had a stretch here of four out of five cards were Hall of Famers. And then you throw Magic and Ralph in there too. That was... That's a lot of Hall of Famers for one pack of cards, you got to admit. I didn't get MJ... But, man, I got a lot of really good cards. So, And I'm kind of, you know, this one, this, this last card has all kinds of crap on it from the, from the gum. So I'm, maybe it'll come off. I don't know if you guys can see that. There's a lot of junk going on there. So I'm glad. Thank goodness. If that would have been the Jordan and it looked so beat up, I would have been bummed. So, so Michael Cage was good, too. So that, that was fun. So thanks for joining me. I know I'm not regular anymore. I pop into your living room once in a blue moon. <laughs> pop onto your phone once in a blue moon. But still, peace and pickleball, peace and pickleball. Life is good. Uh, and when I say peace and pickleball, I'm saying go out and play some pickleball, man. It's fun. <laughs> All right. I'll see you when I see you. <laughs>